956. Bloke, collect your team card sets throughout life. Okay, and, and the lassies too, the ladies too. Now, when I was young, growing up in Barradale and Cooma in New South Wales, Australia, which is south of Canberra, the capital city, um, small town, um, I collected trading cards. Mainly sports cards, but also collected a few bits and pieces of stuff, other stuff. But um, I collected McCannery, Bankstown, Bulldogs cards a fair bit. I'd collect the full sets a lot of the time, but I'd collected my cards. But the thing is, over the years, growing up, I've still persisted many years in collecting those cards. And I, my advice, really, is that we often do this when we're young, when we've got our traders out, our trading cards, we're filling, filling out our sets and things. But... Um, for your team, it can, many blokes, not everyone bothers with a sporting team, but many blokes have a sporting team they follow and a number from for the different codes and things. Get those, go onto eBay or something and buy that base set. I buy my McCann Rebank Sound base sets of the trading cards every every year for most part, for a number of years now. And give that base set, go, go for life for collecting them. Even if... You know, you, you've thrown them out when years ago when you were young and said, I mean, go on to eBay and buy the last 15 years, if you're an older man, 15 years of base sets for your team, your team sets. Just, oh, yeah, $5. Ooh, ooh 1998 costs that much now. Does it? It's not that expensive, 98 but you know what I mean? I mean, dude, it's something you can do in life. It's a hobby. It's a pastime, but get your base sets every year. That's my advice, you know, make, and – Sometimes those special cards and those gem cards at times as well, sometimes, and even occasionally the full box to complete the full set. So it's just, yeah.